Here's what I would offer. This is another opportunity to challenge your belief. My belief is, regardless of what it is that you're calling yourself, regardless of how old you are, regardless of your title, you are a leader. Because you best be leading your own life. And in making that decision, that could change some of the stories that you tell yourself when you are facing opportunities to lead in a more public way. But I think leadership is a choice. I think it's a mindset. I don't think it's a title. I think it's a way of being. And that is about showing up as your best self every single day, every single moment. Can you jump this slide? So I want to talk for a minute about creating possibilities. And can you help me thank this panel? <laughs> so my, my question is this. So what? So now what? So what do we do? What do we do with this information? Great conversation today, yeah? And what? Well, we're going to help you with a couple of things. One is the pledge wall is back there, and Monica and Marsha are going to help you. I'm asking you to sign your name to that. That as of this moment, you will be a champion. You will elevate the need. You will help women and girls. And you'll take active steps. Because nothing happens unless an action happens. Now, we, we can talk about this all day long and into tomorrow. But if each one of us doesn't examine our own beliefs about what we're accountable for, nothing changes. So that, that's the first thing that I would invite you to do. The next thing I would invite you to do is talk about your experience here today with three other people. And the reason I'm telling you that I want you to talk to three other people is because we can measure that. The next time I see you, and I say to you, did you talk to some people? And you, yeah, I talked to two. That wasn't the requirement. <laughs> right? So we'll know. At the end of the day, we'll know. Did we, did it? Did we do it or didn't we? So it's measurable. Because we have to decide today to lead a different kind of conversation that is inclusive of all. With that, I would invite, um, I think that IMSA has a short film that they want to show or, and when we're finished with that part, I will thank you for being with us. And I'm only asking you, before you leave, sign that wall, Take a picture of yourself and your daughters in front of that wall and use the hashtag inspiring heroes in STEM and start to broadcast it. Let's get the conversation happening beyond this room. Betty?